the Bois de Bevon. Oh, for God's sake, Jack. It's the biggest forest in Normandy. Pay attention. I am. It's not there. Well, perhaps they moved it. By my calculations, we're on course. We'll want to bank north two degrees. A five, four, three, two, one, and bingo. The biggest time on to course. All right, everyone, brace for landing. Stream! Jettison the chute! Is everyone all right? Mills! Yeah, I'm fine. Just great. But no, let's go. Let's go. Move, move, move. Come on. Sergeant Evans, glad you're still with us. We're in luck. The Germans haven't responded to our stellar landing. Find a good spot to suppress their bunker. We'll advance behind your base of fire. Achtung! Da sind sie!
Captain, we salvaged the area. Apart from some medical supplies, all we found were a couple of rifles and several panzerfausts, which are woefully inaccurate. Thank God we still have that flat cup. We can use it to hold the bridge until our relief shows up. <laughs>
Evans, destroy that tank to the south! Enemy tank on the southeast coast!
Their friends are coming in from the west. Make sure of your target. Watch your fire. All right, settle down. We've got new orders straight from SOE, as well as two new transfers from the 6th Airborne to help us carry them out. They were highly recommended for this operation as a result of their actions on D-Day. Captain Price, Sergeant Evans, welcome to 3 Troop. Now, let's get down to business. These are the locations of the major hydroelectric dams in the Ruhr industrial region of Germany. Their main purpose is to provide electrical power to the factories and cities throughout the area. Last year, a clever fellow by the name of Dr. Barnes Wallace created an odd sort of bomb that was specially designed to breach these dams. Using these bombs, the dam busters from 617 Squadron successfully breached the Mona and Eder dams, causing extensive flooding and damage to the industrial heart of Germany. The bad news is the bastards have already repaired the damage done, and Bomber Command wants to have another crack at these targets. This is the Eder Dam. We're to make a night drop on this one. From the DZ, it's a day's tab through unpopulated areas around the dam's reservoir. Dropping in any closer is impossible, as the enemy flak is simply too concentrated around the dam itself. Our mission is to locate as many of these anti-air guns as possible, wipe them out so that the bombers can make their runs. This building at the foot of the dam houses the electrical generators. Our orders are to blow this structure in the event that the bombers fail to breach the dam. We set the explosives on a short timer, then get the hell out of there by truck to a nearby airfield and appropriate suitable air transport from the enemy. You all know what to do. Check and test your magazines, zero your sights, and review the maps and photographs carefully. We'll receive signals and embarkation details within the next two hours. Good luck.
Moving to the 
Okay, we're clear to approach. Evans, you and I will need to get below decks and find the armor before we can cripple the entrance. Stick with me, and unless you want Germans to prove, let me handle the talking. Waters, you stay here. Be ready to leave at a moment's notice. Bitte um Erlaubnis, um an Bord kommen zu dürfen. Erlaubnis erteilt. Dürfte ich wohl Ihre Papiere sehen? Wo ist Fregattenkapitän Schmidt? Er musste zu einem dringenden Treffen mit Admiral Dörnitz. Alles in Ordnung. Willkommen an Bord. We should be able to get below to that hangar. Dürfte ich wohl Ihre Papiere mal sehen? Ich muss das überprüfen. Einen Moment bitte. Ich habe einen Offizier hier. Er sagt, er habe Papiere. Hallo? Hallo? Grab a weapon and explosives, quick! The ship's boiler is lying in passageways. Place your charges as we go. This place will be crawling with crumbs.
alle bis zum Himmel! the captain. Damn. He's a very fine man. Let's get the hell out of here.